This is a serious video. And I don't know how to really start. Ooh, maybe by not shaking the camera. All right, guys. Oh. It is really disheartening the amount of bullying and lashing out and nastiness that I am seeing and that I have seen the past few weeks and months within the online autism community. It really makes me sad that people are putting so much time and energy and effort into tearing each other down instead of lifting each other up. Guys, what are we doing? I don't know what to do with that. You know, it's... I understand that people have differing opinions, and that's not a problem. People can have different opinions than you, you know, but the, but the problem is, you know, when someone shares their opinion or something that happened to them or their personal perspective or something that they found inspiring and someone disagrees, and instead of letting that person have their opinion or their beautiful moment, or whatever, this person feels the need to jump on that other person and say, I don't think it's that way, and not, not even in a nice way. I just, I don't even know how to replicate it. But just a bullying way, like bullying that person to retract their opinion. Everyone is entitled to their own opinion. Even if, you know, someone has an opinion that is full of things that are just inaccurate and wrong, you know, they're, you know, people don't bother to check their facts. It's unfortunate. But everyone's entitled to having their own opinion. Whether we disagree with people's opinions or not, it doesn't mean that, you know, um, I don't know. We, we don't need to go around trying so hard to change people's opinions if people aren't open to having them changed. And there's, it's just, people are trying to, you know, come out and share their experiences online and things they've been through or their perspectives. And they're walking on eggshells and they're afraid because if they you know, say something that is not technically correct or they accidentally say something the wrong way or they're new and they don't understand, you know, some of the just history. Um, people jump on them and lash out at them and it chases them out and they don't want to come back and they don't want to share anymore and they shut out and they don't want to be a part of the online community anymore. And, um, you know, it's sad because, you know, we're missing out on those voices that we've chased away and those people are missing out on the discovery and like the networking and the communication and all of the sharing and learning and all of the great stuff that's happening because we've chased them away. Because people are just so nasty and they don't need to be nasty. You know, personally, when someone's nasty to me on the internet, I've gotten to the point where I'm pretty good at just saying, you know what, this is nasty, this is not civil, I'm just going to let you go and I block them. That's it. Um, but some people are new to social media and they're just learning how to use social media. They might not even know how the block button works and how amazing it is. Like on Twitter. Facebook, well I guess you can block people on Facebook too. Um, but Facebook's a little different. But I mean, you know, I hide things from my news feed. Um, because, you know, your mental health is worth it, but, you know, people should be nicer to each other in general. Um, and then those of, you know, if, if you're a little bit sensitive to that, that type of thing, then you should definitely block and hide and not hide, like go hide, but block people and hide people's posts and unfollow freely. 
you know, if that kind of stuff is bothering you and not making a positive contribution to your life. That, so, you know, that's my tip on that too. But I just really dislike bullies and bullying and I just wish everyone would be a little bit nicer to each other. Um, yeah, those are just my thoughts. I'm just a little bit disappointed and I would, I would love to see a little more kindness. All right, guys, I will talk to you next week. <laughs> see ya.